Come. Do you like to Do you like playing the tanky sort of? Go around and hit things. Um, I mean he's okay. I don't. I feel like I'm not using him properly. But. Um, do you want me to play Chogath next game and show you? You know what we can do is go on Murder Bridge and uh, just play one on one, and I can show you things. Oh God. Hold up. And then you can you can absolutely break me. No, it's not. Proving grounds. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna make a password so nobody else can get in. But uh, let's do blind pick. Okay, so mm -hmm. I'm going to invite you. Come on, Pit Beef. Where'd you get Pit Beef? <laughs> I, I don't... I don't... See, here's the thing. I was torn between Pit Beef and Beef Pit. Uh-huh. <laughs> that is quite a predicament. Beef originated from Beef Curtains. Okay. <laughs> okay, so do you want do you want us just both pick Cho'Gath? Or, I can show you some of these other champions if you want. Um, I mean, I have the same champions um, as you do. I, I can just like, random. I can, pick, I can try someone else, too. Sure. Uh, Whatever you like, man. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I random, but that settles that. Oh, okay. So you want me to random too? Oh, I mean, whatever. Like, who did you random onto? Every, pretty, they're all pretty much equal for me because they're new. Um. Well, I mean, so like those five roles that I I told you about the the sort of bruiser top, sort of you know the tanky DPS top, uh, AP carry. Which is mostly using your abilities correctly, um, managing your mana, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. AD carry, which is you know staying alive and doing damages and kiting. It's a lot of clicking. Uh, you know support, which is probably mechanically the easiest role. Um, you know you don't have to last hit and you don't really have to worry about killing people. You just fight when there's fighting and you support your AD carry. Or uh, jungling, which is also mechanically a, a less difficult role because you just fight minions in the jungle and most of the time you're not fighting other champions until you gank. So which one of those roles sounds the mm -hmm. most interesting to you? Uh, I don't know. Uh, junglers typically are more of a support tanky role too. Uh, let's pick a random person. Uh, random, go. They are. Uh, Shivana, sounds good. Before me. <laughs> um, and so Shivana is typically Dude, either a top laner or a jungler. Most people play her as a jungler because she can clear the jungle pretty quickly. She has some AOE damage, and she uh. Mm. You, she can she can run real fast and turn into a dragon and kill people. So yeah, and she's oh. super tanky. She is she's hella tanky, and she does some damage. Okay. Like her base stats are good enough where you can build almost entirely tank items and still do damage. And so yeah, a lot of people like Shivana hmm. from the jungle. Um, oh, we both have jungle champions. Okay. Yeah, Star Scarner is also a jungle champion. He's more AP oriented, but he has his ultimate is awesome. It, it's a stinger, and you sting someone with it, and then you just drag them around. Uh -huh. You get to like grab them for a few seconds, so you just like grab your opponent's AD That's carry, cool. and yeah. they're completely uh, they're suppressed. They can't get out of it because they're suppressed at the time. So you just drag them into your team, and your team just blows them up, and then you win the game. That's how Skarner works. Okay, so on Murder Bridge, you get you get you start at level three, so you can get all three of your abilities if you want, and you start off with a lot more gold, so you can fuck around a little bit more. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Okay, I want to go. So you are a scar, scar, scarner. So I probably need some defense of some sort. What do I want? I don't want that. They should run. I'm just gonna try not to hmm. die. Seems like a good plan. So against uh, eight, Shivana does mostly a AD damage, but her, her damage is kind of split AD and AP. So you know, uh, build health or whatever, or you can just build some damage. Just build, or you can just build a recommended build, and that that should work fine. Oh, I can build a Hydra. Yeah, Fuck I have yeah. no idea. So I'm just gonna go with the recommended thing. Yeah, the recommended builds used to be god awful, and then they like fixed they them. Like me. Where are you? I'm getting some weird lag. It's weird. The weird lag is weird. No, it's not like, it's not like normal like ping. It's like, it's like I tell it to do something and it doesn't show up until a second later on my screen. Might be a video card issue. I don't know. SLI is giving me some problems. The enemies of Demacia will fall. Uh. Oh my god! I don't, I don't know how long her ability is. I never play Shivana. She's super cool though. She's a Dargon. Nope, Chuck Testa. Oh gosh, you have a shield, I forgot. Get away from me! Ah.
You're dead. Uh, oh, oh, my cooldowns aren't up yet. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> 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 yeah. Well. Um, what did you build? I didn't even look. You have a sheen. Um, yeah, you should have attacked me. So what the machine does is, well, you you read the ability right, but essentially after you you do use an ability, your next attack also does more damage. Oh, I'm stupid. Oh my god, I'm so bad at Shivana. My stinger is ready. My stinger is ready. My stinger is always ready for you, baby. Also, uh, if you're still running ghost and heal, you can you can save yourself that way. If you're running away, you just pop ghost and you'll be faster. Mm -hmm. Um, another thing about this game is, in the murder bridge, you can't go back and buy until you die. So yeah, now you know. Why did that do nothing? It did. Look at my look at my thing. If you attack me while I have that thing on me, you get some health back. Like, so what you do with that is uh, y use it on all the minions, and then you attack. You attack the minions. And uh. Oh, oh and it does extra damage. Yeah, it does extra damage and it heals you a little bit. No, go away. I don't like you. You can also get these little healing shrines. Right? Okay. Oh, I don't think you can see my pings. That's true. I was, I was pinging it for you and I was like, wait a minute, you probably can't see it because you're on the other team. <laughs> I'm a Dargon. Yeah. Fuck you. Well then. You know, I shouldn't, I shouldn't be tryharding against. Why am I tryharding? <laughs> um... <laughs> No idea. Sorry, sorry. I, I was gonna show you how to fucking play Cho'Gath, and then, and then it was like, hey, let's random, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> um, if you want, we can just get out of this game. It's all good. I missed because I'm bad at everything. Oh wait, actually, I don't have any abilities left. No good. No, you're dead. You have no health. You build some. You gotta build some more defensive stuff, I think. Like my only item is just gives me a bunch of health. Four hundred health or something stupid. But I'm building towards a Warmog's armor. Yeah, I would say um, with people like Skarner, Shivana, people like us who are tanky. You wanna you wanna build more of a um What the hell that thing does no damage. Uh you, you wanna build more tanky stuff before you build damage. Because your utility's not gonna come from your damage. Your your base stats, everything you're not a carry. And I'm not either. Like Shivana's not a carry right. champion. So I'm just playing build tanky and live through your attacks and then kill you because I'm gonna still be doing damage over time, you know, not a lot, but I still will be. And then yes. I'm gonna survive and you're not. You dickhead. Okay, I have no health. This is not good. Uh, I need a shrine. I need a shrine. I do not like his M I M. No, he took the shrine. Curse you. Oh dear God, like holy shit. Okay, I just flew across my screen. Fly! <laughs> you can't catch me. I'm a dragon. So Yeah, I had heal. I had heal. You have heal too, don't you? Uh probably. Yeah, you click F when you're gonna die and then you don't die. That's what I just did. <laughs> also you can use ghost. Like if I'm getting away from you, you can use ghost and try to catch up with me. Or if you know you're trying to get away, I can use ghost. Uh, I can use guys to catch up with you. I haven't used it yet, but you know, right. you can do that. Right. Oh jeez. Uh-huh. I might just let this tower kill me because I can't buy anything and you're just getting stronger every time you go back. Uh, you have a lot of armor now and it's scary. Yeah, but, you're level yeah, but I have not any health stuff. Okay, I'm just gonna run away. My stinger is ready. <laughs> I like this champion, I think she's pretty cool. She's just I'm not really good at tanky people, I like playing glass cannons. Alright, I'm level 11 now. Hurrah. Great. 
Nah, mine. Mwah. No! <laughs> Curses. <laughs> the might <laughs> yeah, I don't do damage to you anymore. This is good. Oh, fuck. No! You should wait till I'm next to a tower to do that next time. Yeah. That could have been a death. <laughs> oh gosh. I don't know, I find this guard does deceptively large amounts of damage. Ah! Uh. No, I want it, I want it, I want it! Yes! <laughs> Dude, I'm like dead. Why <laughs> are you running away from me? <laughs> Come kill me. <laughs> Okay, yeah, never mind. I do a lot more damage than you. <laughs> yep. That was that kiting thing. Did you see how I, I would attack you and then move backwards? And then attack you and then move backwards? And that way you would have to move up to catch up with me. So it was actually lowering your DPS. If you, would, if you were attack me and then move right after attack animation, you would have kept up with me. But that way I was doing a lot more damage than you because I was kiting you. That's a little bit more advanced. So, I, so that's how you do that. Okay. Um, yeah, it's, it takes a lot of clicking buttons, which is why I like to play ADK, because I like to click buttons. Now, do you want to quit this? Have you had enough? Have you had enough yet? I mean, this is sort of one-sided, because I, I play this game regularly. Oh gosh, I forgot that I have no health. No, 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 run faster! Ah! Yes! Uh, I need that cooldown to be up. Oh, fuck. I think it's more range than I thought it did. They have faced nothing like me. Come on, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh fuck, son of a bitch! <laughs> My stinger was not ready. Okay, I'm gonna My build some damage now. <laughs> Oh, motherfucker. Okay, I have a Ravenous Hydra. I've never used this thing, but I keep seeing people use it, so I'm gonna try it. Ravenous Hydra. Okay, melee only. Life steal applies to damage dealt by this item. Basic clack steal 20 to 60% of total damage as physic damage to targets. Oh, so it's useless against you. Fantastic. Uh, deals 60 to 100% of total attack <laughs> damages. It gives me a little activatable damage, though, so I can try that. Oh, I have some more money. What can I buy? 995. You're catching up, this is no good. Fuck. Damn. No, faggots. Yeah, hell, yeah. You should have kept running yeah, though. I should have kept running into the turret. <laughs> Fuck me. Turrets cannot save you. No, son of a bitch! <laughs> Stop getting those! Ah! Yeah. <laughs> Maha! <laughs> oh fuck, I'm kinda stuck here. <laughs> I can't back because murder bridge rules. I'm just gonna run away. <laughs> God damn it. I need to learn what I'm doing. <laughs> And that's that's the benefits of building tanky is you just don't die and then you run under people's turrets and kill them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But I do kind of like that he's a scorpion. What's up? I do like that he's a scorpion. I I really like Skarner too. I bought him with real money. No, fuck you. Ah! Ha! Ha! How do you like it? <laughs> That's what I was going for, and then he grabbed me. I was like, "No, he's gonna get it!" And then, and then he did. So, and then it was okay. Fuck. No! How did you get away from me? Ah! Yeah. Fucking die! Ah! 
No, yeah, it's murder bridge. Nope. No. <laughs> so much I still have to learn. Oh, this is this is only this type. Oh fuck, I missed. I can't chase you out of your tower anymore. Oh, no, that's okay. If you come out to me, that's cool. I wanna play Gangplank. I haven't played Gangplank before. People are saying he's fun with this item. I'm gonna try. <laughs> I should play Shivana in a game, because like nobody can deal with tanky tanky bruisers in early levels. That should be hella fun. Mm. That was probably a stupid thing I just bought. What'd you buy? I'm pretty sure Scorner is more up you know, I don't even remember the name of it, but I think it, abo it boosted uh, ability power and Frozen heart. Power. Uh, yeah, you, you build. Um, Skarner does some AP, like, his damage is mostly an AP. Okay, I'm not gonna chase you under there. There's two towers there. Oh, fuck, 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 no! <laughs> yeah, I better run. Go fuck so yourself. Oh no, oh no. Oh my god, I barely lived that one. <laughs> <laughs> Almost had me, you son of a bitch. Oh, one thing you can't do on Murder Bridge though is, uh. Okay, you're still dead, right? So, um. It takes like 10 yeah. seconds for the aggro to, to die off. So, basically, uh. If you attack me and I die to tower, within 10 seconds of it, you get the kill. So I have to wait, if I wait more than 10 seconds before getting attacked and die, I get executed and you won't get any money. Now if you're near me and that happens, you'll still get experience, but you won't get any money. So if you have to die, that's the way to do it. Not giving anything. Let's see. I'm gonna go frozen. Oh yeah, all that gold, fuck yeah. <laughs> you're almost level 15. Q. Your Q is like spammable. Your Q ability, the little crystal slash thing, that's like spammable. Just spam that shit. It costs like 20 mana. Just spam, spam, spam. And you have a frozen heart, which means that you have more mana and more cooldown reduction. I'm just gonna wait for this item. They should run. I need more attack speed. I forgot to build attack speed. I'm dumb. Uh, wit's end. Yeah, essential item. Forgot the wit, wit's end. Okay, whatever. We're, we're fine. Damn. Remember to use your, uh, you can use your heal and your, uh, ghost if you need to get away. Uh, I got... You got phage proc to though. Ah! No! No! Come back! <laughs> Curses. Fuck. Ghost sure does make me fast. Yeah. Suffer my Okay. I'm just chasing you. Fuck you. Oh shit! <laughs> Went too far! Ah! No! No! <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I'm so tanky. Look how much damage those towers did to me. Holy shit. Towers, uh, oh, you might not know this, but towers do more damage the more times they hit you. Mm. So if you sit under the tower, you know, you're getting more and more dead every time. Now, I'm gonna end this game because it's getting dull. Yeah. Do you want to play against real people? We can try, but. Excuse me? Why not? You say, you say I'm dull? Huh? Come on, respawn so we can do funny things to Mandrew. I mean, man, the Drew. <laughs> Ran onto your fountain. Look at my dancing. I'm dancing. Look at me. I'm dancing. Oh, you bastard. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> uh. Oh, shit. Okay. Do you want to play against real people? Yes, leveled up. I don't, I don't know if I'm ready. 
Okay, yeah, the thing is, like, the first five levels, I swear to god, everyone is a smurf. I don't know why they... Uh, I don't know, whatever. Point is, everyone is a smurf at level one. Speak for noob or, or what? A smurf is someone like me who is actually level 30 but started a new account to play. Which means that we're way more uh, experienced, we have, we're way better mechanically, you know, we know what we're doing. And so, mm -hmm. it's sort of, yeah, you know, it's... It's meh. Yeah. <laughs> Well, okay. we've been playing for an hour. My recording says an hour and a minute. So, do you do you want to take a break, or do you want to play some people, or what's up? What do you want to do? Oh, whatever you want. I mean, I I'll give it a shot. Can't promise anything, but I'll give it a shot. I'm trying to think how we could do some more learning of what peop the things actually do. Like, let me go look at these champions available. All right. So we got Cho'Gath. You've tried him. Um, he's got a lot of CC. He's got a bunch of big AOE stuff. You never really got his uh ultimate to work the way that it's intended to, so I gotta show you how to do that at some point. Not much. <laughs> um, who did you play in your little battle training game? Um, Rise, I think. Oh, Rise is hella fun. Yeah. You have 435 yeah. RP right now. Yeah. I mean, IP right now, right? Because I have 435 IP. Uh, 403. 403. wonder why that is. Yeah. Um, oh, that's cool. Tarek's on sale. Uh, I'm gonna go to the IP. So, if we play another game, you will have enough IP to buy Annie, Ash, Garen, Kale, Master, Yu, Nu, Nu, Poppy, Rise, Sivir, or Soraka. All of those champions are, well, um, if you go champions and sort by IP, it'll sort by the lowest IP first. On my main account, I have bought all the 450 and all the 1350 champions using IP. Annie, Ash, Garen, Kale, that's Yeah, um, and so Annie is an AP carry. You saw her, she's got a giant fucking teddy bear and she can stun you all. Uh, mm -hmm. Ash is an AD carry. Yeah, it's pretty cool, actually. Annie's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. Um, she's kind of hard to play, though. Well, no, she's not hard. Never mind. Uh, Ash is an AD carry. Uh, she's one of the easier ones because she has a pretty high range. She has almost as much range as Caitlyn, who's my favorite. Um, and she's, she's mm -hmm. an ice princess thing. Funny story. Uh, the the head of the right. company, Riot Games, the head of head of Riot, his name is his uh you know interweb name is Trindamir, and that's a champion in here. If you go look at uh, if you look down, he's yeah. a thirteen fifty AR, it's thirty one fifty. But he's Trindamir. That's the head of the company. And uh, while the people were writing up the lore for this, which the lore for League of Legends is really bad, but while they were writing it up, um. Well, I, I, I can't imagine it was that great. <laughs> no, it doesn't make much sense. But the, the important part is, Ash is Trindamir's wife. And they rule, like, the Frost Kingdom together. And the funny thing is that Trindamir's wife in real life, is name, her name is actually Ashley. Like, that was the intention. But they didn't know that. No they just wrote way. it up that way. It's like, oh my gosh. No way. <laughs> uh, anyways, um, yeah, so... If you, if you want to try out the different roles, uh, Annie's an AP carry, Ash is an AD carry, Garen is one of those tanky DPS kind of things. Uh, people make fun of him because he's, quote, spin to win. Like, he has an ability that he just spins around in circles <laughs> and does a bunch of damage. It's hilarious. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, I've seen that in the other one of the other, your other videos. Yeah, I played Garen in my battle training. That's when I sucked at this game, too. Mm -hmm. uh, Kale is, uh... Kale hey, is... Thanks. <laughs> I was wondering if you were going to pick up on that one. Okay, uh, Kale is a, is a damagey damage. It does, attacks really quickly, and you can build her either AD or AP. And she, her ultimate makes someone on your team invincible. Just straight up invincible. It's weird. Just makes them invincible. You can't die while you have it on you. But it only lasts for a few seconds. Uh, so, like, you use That's it on your... Like, your tank is about to die. He jumps in, and you use it, and he just sits there attacking him, and he can't die. Um, Master Yi... Is can be built both AD and AP as well. He just does a billion damage, and he has an ability that heals him. So you know he's like, in an extended fight, he's not that great, but he does a bunch of front loaded damage, and then you just run away and heal. Uh, Nunu is mostly played as a support. I think he's right now seen as the most OP support because attack speed is so hard to get in this game, and he gives you free attack speed. Um, so yeah, he's played with he's he can be played jungle, but right now he's most most played as a support because just because he gives your ad carry so much he gives you attack speed movement speed and he also has a he has a snowball that stows slows enemies down like for long enough that your snowball will be off cooldown so if you get slowed by the new new train you're effectively slowed till you're dead unless you like unless a friend comes to help you or you flash or something yeah the new new uh -huh. new new freeze train 
Um, so yeah, he's a really good support just for that. You know, he can poke with that snowball all the time and then give your give your AD mm -hmm. carry a lot more stats just for free. Uh, Poppy is a really tanky. I haven't figured out how to fucking play her, but she has a really cute skin, and I bought it just for the really cute skin. Uh, but yeah, I'm not good at Poppy. Some people are really good at Poppy, and it's scary because she can also turn invincible. <laughs> One of her abilities makes her invincible for a little while. Huh. I don't know. It makes her to where only one person on the enemy team can do damage to you. So yeah, you yeah, either that's goofy. so you just like stick it on their support. Oh, is that like a diplomatic immunity thing. Yeah, that thing. So you like you stick on their support, oh, and funny. they can't uh, they can't hurt you. None of their other people can hurt you, and their supports just going there like I don't do damage, and then you just rape their team. Um, <laughs> Rise you played. Rise is one of my That's favorite funny. champions. Rise is so fun because you just build up a ton of mana, and you just go out there and shit on everyone. Yeah, first thing, like most of his stuff is based on his max mana, I think, right? Yeah, so you just build a ton of mana, and then uh, there's a bunch of health items too, like uh, items that give you. Armor and mana, or you know, health and mana, and so <laughs> you just end up having a really tanky rise. Goes around and one shots people because he has so much mana and he's super tanky too. I also really like his uh, Uncle Sam skin. Yes, yes. <laughs> rise is one of the first champions. If you ever watched the uh, League of Legends season one trailer, it's really awesome. Like, and Rise is like the star of it. But yeah, it's, it's really really cool. You should watch it. <laughs> I'll have to link it on the YouTube. I'll put it. I'll put it under here in the description when I post this up. And then you can go there. That's fine. And you can watch yourself you play. This giant freaking post thing up? I'll like probably split it up into games. Days? I'll split it up into games. It's fine. Yeah. But yeah, it has taken like a day to upload one of these before. <laughs> sure. We saw I played with one of my friends. Uh, I played with my friend Patton from high school. A few yeah, months I've watched ago. those. Yeah, he's he's played for a little bit longer than you have. I think he's probably higher level than me now. I mean, he's clearly better than I am. But he's played for a fine. while. I can accept that. <laughs> he watches it too, oh, though. Man. Like I learned the most by watching pros play and uh, seeing what they do, because you know, I, I, after a while, oh, it's okay. like mechanically you can practice and you know you can get all of the creeps and stuff and you can practice doing that. But eventually, mm -hmm. it comes down to you know your game knowledge as well and where how you position yourself and you have to know when to engage. Team fighting is probably the hardest part of this game. Because it's really easy, like, if you get into a team okay. fight to just freak out. Um, Claire does that every time we try to play. She just yeah. freaks out. And, and, like, she doesn't know what to do. And she starts running around and not doing damage and not using her abilities correctly. And, yeah, that's one of the hardest things to do is yeah, to like team I'd fight. Fall under that, uh, it takes a lot of practice, you know. You have to play for a while. I've I played this game a sure. lot. I used to play this game a lot. I haven't played since the Season 3 started much mm -hmm. at all. So, um, mainly just playing ARAMs. Playing okay. Lux and ARAMs. Uh, Sivir, Sivir is another AD carry. Let me get through the 450s. Which I, you know, I don't want to stop in the middle. So Sivir is another AD carry like Ash. She she does a lot of uh, burst damage. And uh, her ultimate is really good. Mm -hmm. It, like, it eff effectively gives your entire team ghost. Yeah, yeah um, you know what ghost does? You just use her and it makes you super fast for a few seconds. Her ultimate basically right. gives your entire team that for a few seconds. So like if, you, cool. if you're running away or you're about to engage, you just pop it, your entire team gets faster and Sivir gets uh, extra attack speed and you just pew 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 and they die. Mm -hmm. And then Soraka is probably the uh, <laughs> the easiest support to learn how to play. She just has a heal, she has an ability that gives you mana. That ability, if you use it on an enemy, will silence them. She has a Q that you don't even have to aim, it just, it's called Star Call or, or Starfall or something and it just attacks everything close Starfall, to you. Yeah. yeah, and then her ultimate heals everyone on your team. It's super easy to use, uh, <coughs> super easy to learn. It might be my favorite support to play because I can sit there and not care and just poke at the enemy and heal my AD whenever he needs healing and fantastic. I love Sarah. <laughs> but yeah, those are all the 450 champions and if you want to learn, like, you can play you can play any of those in the roles I described and Garen can be played in the jungle, Kale can be played in the jungle, Master Yi can be played in the jungle, Nunu can be played in the jungle. So if you want to learn any of the roles, you can just pick one of these 450 ones, which is like two or three games worth of play. And yeah. Yeah, and just well, learn it that way. Probably. Yeah, well, I mean, that last one didn't really... We didn't get a lot of points from that last game. We got... Yeah, I got 83 yes. IP. But yeah, you typically get 150, mm -hmm. 200 maybe for a game. Um, mm -hmm. If you want to play a game right now, we can. These uh. runes and stuff. I don't know. I, I, oh. I'll play one more if you want. <laughs> sure. If you uh, want. Do you have stuff to do today? Like, I don't know. You got a call earlier. Not really. <laughs> All right, I have to I, write... Yeah, uh, that was... No, someone's... Uh, you, so you actually do have better things to do? No, I just have to write a report before, like, next Wednesday or something. <laughs> That's it. I don't have much to do this weekend. I, I, I can if do it you all tomorrow. Go do that, you should go do that. That's um, I don't feel like doing it right now. <laughs> I'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> well, I mean, that's not going to change tomorrow. No, but I can do it tomorrow and play video games right now. 
I'm just kidding. Well, I'm I'll, okay with that. I'll probably do it uh, this <laughs> afternoon some, or after dinner. I tend to be more productive okay. in writing when I'm past, I don't know, when I've had my dinner. Yeah, yeah. Well, cool. If you want, we can play Castle Crashers. Okay. You can show me a play. Or we can play another game. That's true, too. Oh, hang on. I gotta uh, go help my roommate take in the uh, groceries because he just went shopping. <laughs> Fun. So I'll be, I'll be right back. Yeah. Alright, well, we'll take a break right here. I should kill the stream and see how the quality is.